In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to quickly update the default project file settings for every new file that you create, and specifically, how to set a default frame rate of 25 frames per second. So whenever you create a new project in Cinema 4D, you're going to see your project settings and inside of there, your frames per second. And by default, this is 30 frames per second, which is pretty close to the NTSC standard of 29.97 frames per second. Now, I'm gonna set this to 25, which is the PAL standard or the standard that's more common in Europe. Now, having done this, I also have to update my render settings. So I'm gonna go into render settings, output, and change my frame rate here to 25. Now. Having done this, I want to ensure that this is my default for all pro project files that I create. So to do that, I'm going to go to Edit, Preferences, and choose to open up my Preferences folder. And I'm doing this so that I can get the path to my Preferences folder, or what I can also do is just take this folder and drag it into my Quick Access right here. So now that I've got the path for my Preferences folder, I know where I need to save my new file. So I'm going to go to File, save, and I'm going to load up that same preferences folder. I'm just pasting in that uh, address or going to the uh, folder that I saved in my quick access here. And I'm going to give this a special name, and that name is new.c4d. I don't believe that the capitalization matters. I like to use a capital N. And now when I press save, we'll see that this file is saved as new.c4d. I'm just going to choose to close all. And now you'll notice that whenever I create a new project file, my frames per second here is set to 25. My project length is 75 frames, which is the same three seconds. And my render settings are also set to 25 frames per second. Now this is a technique that you can use to set up all sorts of defaults. You can even add preset objects to every scene that you create.